we were meant to create. Sometimes our desires to create are blocked spiritually, mentally, emotionally, or even physically. And this prevents us from reaching our highest aspirations. If you are an entrepreneur or you would like to become one and you're in need of some sage advice and direction, then you're in the right place. As a successful entrepreneur, spiritual guide, and intuitive business coach, I can offer you the clarity and support you need to find success and reach your goals. With decades of experience as a trusted tarot card reader, a franchise owner, my practical and spiritual approach to entrepreneurship will help you reach your full potential as an established business owner. Whether you're struggling with making tough decisions or simply trying to find your path in life, I can help you learn the tools you need to create your business dream. Take some time today and schedule your free consultation with me so that we can begin to make your business dreams a reality. Hi Aquarius, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. So this reading is going to be about what can the Aquarius expect for the um, remainder of October, October 2022. What can Aquarius expect? All right, so thank you God for blessing Aquarius with a clear, concise message from you. What can Aquarius expect? October wallflower. All right, so some of you are not going to get out there and dress up and you're going to kind of soak at home. I hope it's not you. I hope it's somebody else. But this is what can Aquarius expect for the rest of October. So get up, get out there. Maybe you're going to just be, you know, in the midst of a party, right? Because she's in the middle of a party and you're just not even there mentally. Maybe you don't want to be around these certain people. You're kind of over it. You're looking for something higher, higher vibrational. Your soul is crying out for something so much more. Let's see. Um, you could be like, you could dance at a nightclub or you could like, I don't know. You could be in a, a performer of some sort. You're just not in it anymore. Let's see. Um, you could expect true love uh, in the month of October for the remainder of October. True love. You may be finding your true love. Now, this could be in the form of a person. This could be in the form of a passion, a passion project. Uh, finding your true love, your um, maybe your true life purpose also. Okay, let's see. What can we expect? Uh, twin flames. So some of you could be true uh, a true love and spiritual growth so yeah some of you just really want more you just don't want to be around these low vibrational energies you used to be that way you're not that way anymore you don't want it um some of you could expect to grow spiritually from this twin flame union um know that it came into your life for a reason um or this person came into your life for a reason uh, maybe for a season to show you something about you so that you could grow spiritually. So maybe that you could find um, God or God like complex or um, the Tarot or something like that. Expect the unexpected from the least expected person also. OK, so do expect the unexpected from somebody you at least expect it from. What else can Aquarius um, expect for the month of October? 2022 it looks like you've been in some twin flame union maybe it's been very turbulent hard because the other person doesn't want the union or vice versa you don't want it um it's just been like a tug of war you don't see eye to eye you don't want the same thing this relationship pushed you to um ask the questions as to why what for uh why me why do i feel this way and so forth and it maybe, you know, led you down the rabbit hole of finding the tarot, finding uh, Reiki healing, finding meditation, going to church, you know, whatever it may be. So let's see what else is going on for the Aquarius for the month of October. A gift. All right. So a gift could be coming to you, Aquarius, maybe by way of the universe. A blessing is what I just heard. The 17th is the number of Aquarius in the Tarot. So it's definitely maybe a big major wish, a gift coming to you, Aquarius. What is coming to Aquarius? Something that you're expecting, expectation. 
You've been wishing, hoping, praying on a star, praying to God that this comes through for you and you're expecting it. So you're in a season of um, receiving expectation here. Let's see what is coming towards Aquarius in the month of October. Some of you are moving, having a quick, fast change here. Let's see what is coming to Aquarius. Okay. Sudden wealth. Oh, lots of, so luck could be on your side. Seven, seven, seven. Um, something that you manifested with the 11 card. Okay. Um, big hope, wish, dream, blessing. You were in a place of expectation coming out of a place of lack curse. Um, I heard debauchery. Okay. I don't know what's going on. Aquarius. Suddenly you're going to have, um, major tectonic breakthrough breach wealth um sudden wealth aquarius suddenly it all comes together for you it could have something to do with maybe breaking free of a relationship or um, contractual agreement or maybe you were written into somebody's will or something of that nature um there could be somebody in deep dark concern maybe even slipping into depression about you about circumstances i heard your father could be your father let's see somebody don't want you to find out something don't want you to know it they want you to stay oblivious to it what is this for aquarius yeah so there is some man here where um you're on their mind in their thoughts a lot they're thinking about you who you're with what you're doing how you're doing it where you're going where you live what, they're really thinking concern deep concern and thoughts about you what is going on here for aquarius well, a lot of masculine energy there could be a masculine energy here that is an Aquarius who's doing a lot of thinking about, you know, maybe they don't have to pay out a lot of money. A judge is going to order something. Um, somebody here was, um, they pulled the wool over somebody's eyes here. There was trickery, deception here. Someone is calculating or being calculated in their next move. Yeah, somebody's trying to move here with the change card. It, it was showing its face. This is what you can expect. Wow, great fortune. When you have these in the same spread, it looks like some big money is coming to you, Aquarius. Well, I can't make it up. And then you're going to be the privileged lady or the privileged man here where you just kind of take it easy. You rest it on easy street. So this looks really good for you, Aquarius. Um, it looks like whatever you have been uh, um, praying for, wishing, hoping, praying for in terms of contractual agreement, getting something together, getting someone to sign, um, getting something, you know, out of getting paperwork done, you know, um, things moving forward, maybe selling your house, moving on. Um, it looks like it's going to happen for you. Hang in there, Aquarius. Let's see what else happen, happening for Aquarius for October 2022. Uh, yeah, you're waiting. You've been waiting, Aquarius. Love in reverse. You ain't got no love for somebody who had several secret affairs and they were hiding it from you. Okay. Um, you're done with that. You're done waiting on this person. You're waiting for the money. You're waiting for the opportunity to move. You're waiting for your life to change, but you're not waiting on this person depressed in reverse. You're no longer depressed about this. Maybe the other person is because this situation or this person was hard to handle. Okay. Um, somebody's grown bored with the drama birthday is coming up around maybe around your birthday around someone else's birthday uh circumstances will be different why is birthday here why is birthday here somebody is horrible with money horrible with valuable things so somebody's birthday could be what is this um libra maybe libra could be horrible with money quick to blow money they could be a low life they found kindness in you okay this could even be that somebody's horrible with valuable things and there was value with you Aquarius and they didn't treat you right they treated you you know um, like you were nothing or like you you know they didn't handle the relationship correctly it's all because they are low life they just didn't have the capacity to be what you needed them to be you know maybe you just bet on the wrong horse Aquarius it, you know sometimes you just got to look at it for what it is let's see um bothered somebody is bothered by you we do have like a father or masculine energy bothered and um, they wonder what you know or what you don't know yeah about a house or something love um there could be a masculine energy bothered 
not sure if you're in a new house or a new relationship or a new love somebody is really wondering what you're doing how you're doing it who you're with where you're going i mean like they they are bothered um you don't take this person serious at all and you may have even put up boundaries with this person um likable um maybe their likability is gone or you just can't trust anything they say therefore you don't like them anymore yeah somebody could be in a relationship or a house that they're miserable in or somebody is miserable, misery loves company, body goals. Somebody could be looking at you and, you know, trying to compare themselves, either their body of work or their actual body to yours. You're telling somebody you have not healed. You need to heal. What is going on here? Anniversary. So this is somebody that you were like in a relationship with. Um, there could even be somebody who wants to come back. They want to have some type of anniversary reunion with you. They'll say anything just to date you. They've not been there for you. Uh, now they're straight up stalking you because at first they were leaving you out and, you know, not caring for you and didn't treat you with respect or regard. Now they're stalking you. This is just, yes, now someone's, you are my sunshine. They want to be honest with you um, that they're divorcing or that they don't like that you've divorced them. They want to tell you that it just costs too much maybe to divorce. They don't know how to do that. It's not smart. It's not a good idea. I can't make it up. Yeah. They, they're worried about their resources. What else is going on for Aquarius for the month of October? Somebody's all talking, no action. They just el cheapo for real. Like, um, they just give as little as possible, whether it's money, time, energy, anything. They'll give you as little as possible just to keep you holding on because they know they don't really have anything to give. So it's just like, well, let me just give these crumbs so that they feel like it's more. There's nothing more but what they're giving. Yep, can't make it up. Their beard, they're hiding that there's nothing behind this smoking mirrors this falsehood you know they're hiding behind this beard this person could have gray hair they're giving you gray hair you've been dealing with this situation for far too long they feel like you're warm but they're a con man or a con woman a fraud a liar everything they say is cap somebody's been lying to you since the day they met you been lying about you they read you very well especially after the first conversation and they tried to they mutated morphed into what they thought you would like likability okay likable mm -hmm. you make them happy now they're fiery or they're fired up that you've moved on or you don't want this anymore can't make this stuff up fired up that you ghosted them or you're ghosting them whoa all these cards fell on the ground all right so that you've asked them to text me don't call me um march their birthday could be in March or something happened in March. They wanted to be friends with benefits. They wanted you as their side chick forever, a side dude forever. They had a side dude, side chick. Um, it could have been a Piscean person or I don't know. It could be anybody here. But it's like somebody wanted you to um, just tolerate, deal with. Um, and you didn't and you left and they're absolutely um, mad at you. And again, you had stalking you and them studying you. Now they're, they're watching you. By Christmas, you can hear from this person. Yep, it's all true. Um, now they're obsessed with you. They love everything about you. They're trying to think fast as to how to bring this relationship out of retirement. Okay. Um, but you, they're nothing but a thug. You know, so they're always thinking of the next come up. Let's get you some advice for the rest of October, Aquarius. What is the advice? Okay. What is the advice for the rest of October for Aquarius? What is the advice for the rest of October? This is somebody here. Um, that this is displacement. Like you used to be strung out on them and chasing them and wanting the relationship. You finally, you know, got out of that. And now everything that you used to feel for them, they feel for you. And you're now you're, like they were kind of nonchalant don't care I, I don't really want to be involved in it anymore so it's just like 
this is um this is game the cat and mouse game it's time to leave this alone move on um let's see what's the advice for aquarius extremely happy you're going to be extremely happy aquarius and we saw that in the kipper deck um you're gonna get money that comes into your bank account you get a job you win the lottery or a game you receive a promotion a clean bill of health whatever it may be you're going to be extremely happy aquarius what else advice um you are can't make it up you are a good person therefore i can't let you go i will never find anyone like you this is all this is why they're chasing you so well you think it's love and you think that they come to their senses about you no they just know that they're not gonna find you know another doofus not to call you a doofus aquarius but they're not gonna find another good person like you okay um somebody is catty petty dramatic and gossipy and a warmonger this is um negative feminine energy okay um so it could be a woman it could be a man in the feminine energy somebody is was a, a sex worker they don't want to be involved in this any, anymore only fans exotic dances escort pay for play whatever it doesn't matter somebody's like i just don't want to be involved in this anymore uh negative forces can use the people we love most to harm us or keep us stuck yeah so it's like somebody saying i'm tired of this low vibrational thugged out um you know low vibrational life what whomever because we had thug come out twice or something like thug life and then thug now whatever somebody's tired of this the other woman will do anything to keep him trapped in a relationship so somebody will do anything to keep you trapped in a relationship aquarius or this is what another woman is doing someone is addicted to social media will do anything for followers like subscribers and shares this person is completely out of touch with reality and you need to be very cautious of people like that because most times you'll find that they are overly sexual overly aggressive maybe you're dealing with someone like that and you're just tired of it you just want to be around something high vibing we saw that earlier in the cars for you you could be in the midst of a party or party type environment or you work as a bartender or a bottle girl or a dancer or, or i don't know whatever and you're just like i need peace in this place no you have no peace i'm ready to get out of it um advice for aquarius and we'll close out advice for aquarius advice yeah you just need peace with the temperance card it's just like you you can't it's, it's you just feel like how do i get my life in order i'm trying to mitigate i'm trying to do the the the, the middle take the middle ground here i don't want to be you know all out there nor am i trying to be some super you know religious high roller or holy you know um holy than thou but i can't be in this no more it says that you're protected aquarius it's like it says with the temperance card it talks about getting your life together the three of wands here it says um take the lead you can do it if you want to get out of something take the lead there's something that you do or you can be you can do you know online or website or something like that e-commerce putting it out there it says that you can do this let's see what else it says it's protected or the universe is trying to help you yeah, four of cups okay yeah you need to turn down somebody's offer because they're gonna come back offering you something it could be a king of cups so somebody who has a lot of different people can deal with a lot of different people secret society um with the justice card um you know that you need somebody wants to do right or do something right or give you a gift but it might be under false pretense. Yeah. And if you start this relationship back up, that's all you're going to get is a false start. You know, no progression because this person is not settled within themselves. There's a lot of love between the two of you. And you might even be twin flames. But somebody doesn't want to leave another person behind or they feel like they can or there's heavy, you know, I was about to say spell work. And then the devil came out with the three of pentacles spell work on them that they need to break or they got to pray about breaking you know, the ten of wands so it's like negative karma energy you know attached to this person so it's going to be like an uphill battle for you universe spirit god might even want you to just leave this alone for now all right so aquarius this is what i have for you many blessings to you thank you for being here all links are below if you want to get your own personal reading um yeah if you want to get your own personal reading, readings are 40% off. Use code 40 off at checkout.
And if you took something from the reading, you can always give back. You could buy me a coffee. Yep, the link is below. It says buy Ella coffee. Uh, catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night at 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. Um, shout out to New York, L.A., Atlanta, Dallas, Houston, Philadelphia, London, Chicago. I have high viewership there, Florida, Minnesota, or Minneapolis, one of those. Um, let me know where you are viewing from. That would be good. You go ahead and type that down below. And if you want to be a part of um, a monthly conference call where we talk about all things spiritual and practical to either start, maintain, or grow your business, go ahead and sign up for the KTMG monthly conference call. The link is below. And if you want to get on this, on this, and if you want to get on a discovery call with me, uh, the link is below. A uh, discovery call will see if I can be of assistance to you, helping you get your business off the ground and see if um, you'll be a good fit for me. All right. So um, that's complimentary. Take advantage of that. Go ahead and schedule that for yourself. Uh, take the next step now. All right. Many blessings to you, Aquarius. Take care.